What kind of goals motivate you the best? That's exactly what we're going to talk about today. What is up, my winning friend? My name is Zach, and welcome back to another video. And if this is your first time here and you want the best tips on how to dominate your goals, make sure you hit the subscribe button, tap the bell notifications, that way you don't miss anything. And we're going to get started right now. Yeah, we some go -getters. We're going to get started right now. Right we now. Some go -getters. So we're going to break down these goals into four separate categories and we're going to and we're going to make goals based off of these four categories because these four categories are the four different areas that are going to motivate you the best and give you the, mo the most motivation to actually act on these goals, you know, because a lot of times, you know, we'll set goals and we just don't really have the motivation and drive to pull through with them. But by setting the correct goals, goals that are meaningful, that actually align with your purpose, it gives you that spark, that energy, that drive to even do the things even when you don't feel like doing them. So let's dive right on in. Okay, so the first set of goals that we're gonna set, the first area is personal development goals. Now, when I say personal development, that doesn't mean just you know reading and learning stuff, which that is a huge part of the personal development, and I highly encourage encourage it but we're talking about relationships emotional uh, spiritual goals physical what what kind of shape do you want your body and what kind of health do you want to achieve those sort that that sort of nature right there and when you personal development goals are really important because when we're not growing in life when we're not actively learning growing becoming more connected uh, spiritually uh, we're, we're really dying if we're not growing um, we, we don't feel that fulfillment in life whenever we are not actually attempting to grow and the only way to actually grow is by doing it and uh, when you're in those tough situations when you're when you're being tested that's a good thing because that means you're actually doing something that's forcing you to grow to become more and that's the goal that's what we're aiming for now the second area of goals that are going to motivate us the the most is career business and economic goals and that isn't just what kind of career do you want to have that's part of it, but we're going to get even more detail, like what kind of milestones do you want to hit in your career? What do you want to achieve during your career? What kind of business do you want to own? How much do you want your net worth to be? How much money do you want to make annually? What kind of investments do you want to make? All these things. Money is a huge motivator in a lot of people, and it is me. It's not the number one motivator. Legacy is my number one motivator, but yes, I am motivated by money because money allows me to do more of the things that I want to do. It allows me to reach more people. It allows me to have more time freedom, more freedom to do the things that I want. So there's nothing wrong with being motivated by money. The third goal that we're going to focus on, well, the third area of goals that we're going to focus on is toys and adventure. Now, what kind of what kind of house do you want? What kind of car do you want? Uh, do you want a boat? Do you want to own an airplane? All those sorts of things fall into the toys category in adventure. Where do you want to visit? Where, do you want to go to Thailand? And what kind of experiences do you want to have? Do you want to visit New York and go to a Broadway show? All these goals, write these down because these are great motivators and these are uh, great to scratch off the bucket list. Uh, why not? Why not set goals and actually go for things and do them now instead of waiting until the end of our career to actually go ahead and, and live? We should start living right now. We, we shouldn't work all of our lives to live at the very end. Let's start living right now. So let's start setting toys and adventure goals. And finally, the fourth area of goals that are gonna motivate you more than anything else, and this one in particular is my favorite. I get the most fulfillment from these types of goals, are contribution goals. How can you contribute in your own little way that will make the world a better place? How can you push humanity forward in your own special way? What, is, what, what kind of gifts do you have or what do you, what do you enjoy doing the most that contributes to someone else or to the world in general that make it a better place? These goals I found personally give me the most fulfillment. I, I, I enjoy them because whenever you're a part of something bigger than yourself and you can actually help someone else, there's no feeling better than that. I mean, money cannot even come close to actually helping someone solve a problem. So those are the fourth, that's the fourth category, contribution goals. One quick little tip. So 
we had the four different goals. We have our personal development goals, our business, career, and economic goals. We have our toys and adventure goals, and we have our contribution goals. What I like to do and what will make you more effective when you do this is when you can tie these goals together. Like for an example, uh, most of my goals, my personal development, my business, and my um, contribution goals all tie in together. Like they all play off one another. When I'm reaching one, it's also helping me progress in other areas. So when you can tie them all together for a, a singular purposeful action where where you have a destination in mind that's gonna that's all these goals play a part with each other you become more effective you become more purposeful and uh, life just becomes to take on a more it becomes more meaningful it begins to take on a different purpose so find a way to tie these goals together and you'll watch your effectiveness just explode if you enjoyed that video and or if this is your first time here and you have not downloaded uh, the goal getter cheat sheet yet I highly recommend doing so inside of this goal getter cheat sheet we talk about these four specific area of goals and we also go through the whole entire process of how to align with your purpose how to set these goals how to set up your values how to break them down all that so you can dominate your goals if you want to check that out you can do so for free by downloading it right here and as always i appreciate you guys jumping on here each and every video showing the support um, if this video has impacted you or if this channel has impacted you in any way shape or form please do me a favor by sharing it out with someone that could possibly use the information given here and as always keep crushing those goals and i will see you next time we're getting started right now right now Get us all